Hi there, this is Eva with Creative Imaginations. Starting this month, I will be bringing on a new feature each month, which will be technique driven. This month, I chose to work with real wood papers and showing you fun ways to create with it. I made these three ATC cards to showcase the techniques with it and hope you will like what you see. So let's get started. On my Life is Beautiful ATC, I use Samantha Walker's Spellbinders Antique Frame and Accents. I simply die cut it and to highlight the design I dry brushed some white acrylic paint and that is all you need. To decorate my ATC I use Samantha Walker's Life is Beautiful Unity stamp set which I painted in with my favorite twinkling age tools. Um, my favorite colors. On my Love ATC I did some dry embossing and I use Spellbinders New Velour Embossabilities folders. Um, and once I embossed the paper, basically I just took my paper, run it through my cuddle bug, and once I embossed the paper, I once again dry brushed some white acrylic paint on it. So you can basically see the effect of it um, pretty, well, pretty well, and I'm actually lathering quite a bit on there, a little more than I should, but you can get the effect of it just by a little lightly brushing it on. So, and that's kind of how I did that. And um, the rest of the ATC, um, I finished uh, with Mara Johnson's Monarch die cut frames, uh, which I painted in with Twinkling Age Tools. And the Little Love stamp is by Just Right Stamps from their Winter Word set. My last ATC showcasing wet embossing on real wood paper. For this ATC, I worked with my favorite things inspired by butterflies and inspired by love sets. I simply inked up my butterfly stamp with Versamark embossing ink and um, using white embossing powder I embossed it and basically here is what it looks like you know once um, you embossed it. All I did is I cut it out and once I cut it out then I painted it in with my um, Luminart um, Twinkling H2 so basically you get a really beautiful effect. What I like about the wet embossing is that um, it's very easy for you to follow the lines. You can pretty much stay within the lines instead of running out. Um, and um, again, you just cut it out and you just add it to your ATC and that's pretty much it. So it's very simple. Um, all you need is some uh, wet embossing, um, some white um, or black even would work too, um, embossing powder and then you can just go away and paint. Well, that's it. Hope these inspire you to pull out some uh, real wood papers and create some fun projects with it. Thanks for watching.